Hello everyone. There is the question answers of chapter number 3 selfless service. Question number A. Complete the summary of the story. Once Swami Vivekananda was at a railway station in Rajasthan. People gathered around him and asked many questions. Swami ji was tireless tireless means bina thake in answering them he spoke for 3 days and 3 nights on the third night a poor man came to him and seemed concerned that swami ji hadn't eaten or had water swami ji to him swami ji asked him to get him rotis r o t i e s rotis but the poor man was a cobbler cobbler matlab mochi jo jute silta hai c o b b l e r by profession and he was hesitant to give swami ji food that he had made but swami ji insisted on having food that the poor man has prepared and while swami ji was eating the rotis some gentle men g e n t l e m e n gentle men plural form saw it and they were annoyed but swami ji told the men that he could not overlook the humanity h u m a n i t y humanity that the poor man displayed now question number b is answer these questions number 1 how did people keep swami ji engaged for 3 days and nights answer is people kept swami ji engaged for 3 days and 3 nights by asking him many questions question number 2 what did the poor man notice answer the poor man noticed that swami ji had been talking relentlessly relentlessly means tirelessly for 3 days and had not taken even a single drop of water question number 3 why did swami ji feel that god had himself prepared appeared in front of him when he saw the cobbler answer is swami ji felt that god himself had appeared in front of him when he saw the cobbler because he was the first person who had asked after him or cared for him in Three days. Question number four. What did the poor man think as he went back home? Answer is, as the poor man went back home, he thought that he could not leave Swami Ji in that state. His eagerness. to serve a monk overpowered his fear question number 5 after the selfless service of the cobbler what did swami ji think of think to himself answer is after the selfless service of the cobbler swami ji thought to himself that there were so many people just like the selfless cobbler 
who were living in the small huts of the country unnoticed these people were materially poor and of so called humble origin yet they were noble and large hearted question number 6 what was the main difference between the poor cobbler and the other disciples of swami vivekananda how did they reveal their true nature to swami ji answer is the other disciples made swami vivekananda talk without respite for 3 days and did not care if he had taken or he had eaten or taken rest on the other hand it pained the poor cobbler very much that swami ji had not taken any food or water in the last 3 days when swami ji asked him to bring him the food he was scared of being punished by the king however his eagerness to serve swami ji won over his fear the true nature of the gentleman was revealed when they objected to swami ji eating the food made by the poor cobbler they condemned the cobbler for his caste completely ignoring his humanity this was the main difference the cobbler being poor had a large heart and was selfless whereas the gentleman being rich and belonging to high caste were petty and selfish